Hey, again, right now this morning, it's me, it's tw uh, I'm 11.30ish, and I'm moist handy. Now, this, this morning, what I do, I walk around in circles. Like, this is my radio. I just, I had the Bluetooth connected just now, earlier. And, but in order to film, I had to disconnect the audio. This is my old bicycle, but I did, ultimately, I cleaned it all very nice. I have a brush after I finished using the brush, I left it in the shower. It's just been greasy in there ever since I got to clean that up. Here's the ceiling where there's an exterior edifice crack. This window mechanism. Eh. That's how it opens. I guess there's been little stink bugs get in here. That must be where they're coming in. <sighs> that water comes down every time it rains and drips. Makes, it forms a nice puddle right here. Here's the puddle. It rained recently, but that doesn't seem wet. It rained like two days ago. It was hot yesterday. Every day is so hot. Every day they predict, they say it's a severe weather alert, a severe thunderstorm watches for this area, the city of Falls Church and Arlington County and Fairfax County and all this. Well, how do I know if they're lying or not? Sometimes they say that the, the severe weather alert is just canceled, and then it's just they, it's just, they pretend as if uh, for breakfast. This is so, it's so nice. It's I didn't know this about it, but it's actually from Norway, a Norwegian tradition, except for the fact that. They say packed in Poland, right here. You have to read the fine print and you have to pay attention to what you're paying for, I guess. I, what I wanted was some Spanish or some Portuguese sardine from, from, those, from those waters down that way. I suppose the same species of fish swim all over the place. This, this bicycle used to take me all over the place. I, I, I really, I, I w would appreciate loading a 110 pounds right here. It says, it, it, it is, it says 50 kilogram. Oh, is what it says, 50 kilograms. I want to load this up. <laughs> Take it for a trip. I'm gonna go fishing one time or another. I need I need a place to put the cooler. Here's the fish for this morning. This is the fish. Okay, King Oscar. That's right from the BJ's. I gotta squeeze my abdomen. I'm such a skinny man. This is how I sit at the table every time because I've, I broke my spine, so I need to, I need a way to reinforce my posture. So I, I have the black coffee every morning. Like usual. I already had like toast with butter and jelly. It was delicious. The strawberry jam. This is my makeshift tripod for this ASMR mukbang. 
the 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 the, 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 the fish. The, see, this is the breakfast. This is the sardines and rice. For for this is going to be able to sustain me for this morning. I ended up. I biked. I biked last night at 11 p.m. So. I was going <clears throat> slightly faster than usual, <clears throat> and and no one got in the front of me. Nobody was behind me. The streets were all evacuated totally. I was on my own, a bicycle cowboy. I mean, mm, the DMV is just like the Wild West, except on the East Coast. In, in along DC for the bicycle cowboy and go traveling around if you want a nice trip mm. you want to travel like a long distance and go, go those extra miles miles that you didn't even know you would go before you unplanned type of distances like just you go a certain way and then you just end up Travel like a little bit farther than every time, just a little bit. See how far you get. <laughs> mm. I've always just fantasized about doing some kind of a camping thing, but on a proper, like a motorcycle, I'd be able to maybe build one DIY. But last time I tried that, it was kind of. A little, a little sketchy. I didn't like it. It's, it scares me. Just the idea of that, though. Still, though, I, I, I dream big. I gotta aim high. Mm. It goes, it goes like, he who sits high but looks down low. Yeah, that's that's the proverb. I, I gotta. I don't. I don't read. So you see, all I do is I hear things on my radio. I'm a. I'm I'm an auditory type of listener. I don't read anything. Of all the medical textbooks that I've read, I guess I suppose that information is more fresh in my mind than say the algebra and geometry in high school. But I can remember only the tiny bit of the Photoshop things, which was ages ago. Photography has fallen out of style. We don't have no camera, no film, no nothing anymore. It's just smartphones with cameras on them now. They replaced it all. It destroyed the whole art. It's just very tiny, small, non-existent, if at all, anymore. The COVID destroyed it. It wrecked it as, as an art form. It removed some, a, a certain level of creativity that we had before. Oh, I need... I want, I want a little more than this. This would be sufficient. And each one of these cans is 106 grams net weight that includes the oil and the fish inside, which is 3.75 ounces, three and three quarter ounces total. I don't bother draining the oil because that's a part of the, a portion of the nutrients. That's what you're paying for in the whole can. Why would you waste your money? <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> a little ASMR canned seafood mukbang fish review. Nice. 
looking looking like a a good presentation right here. <laughs> This is a fresh, refreshing can taste. Mm. And it would last like a lifetime, I guess, in the can if it's, the seal is okay and everything. Mm. The main thing is you, it's stored inside of a cool and dry, quiet place without like, not like in the back of a car or, I suppose if you had a can of sardines in the, inside your truck, you wouldn't be that hungry for just about one evening. You can have the sardines in a backpack also, like, take it hiking. I don't do much of that, though. I already have to walk miles and miles with my job, so why would I bother doing it? Getting like hiking boots? No, I'm I'm gonna keep on wearing some work boots. It's I got the Timberlands, man. I, I can't hike in those heavy heavy thing with the steel toe. No way. No, could never work. I've 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 biked in them though successfully. I would always bike with those t type of style of shoes every time I ride the bike. I wear the Timberland boots. I'm not ashamed to admit, every time I get on my bicycle, I have platform pedals, and I am wearing Timberland boots with some actual Hanes work socks. Like some good work socks with, that absorb the moisture like a sponge. This is what I get on my feet to have the highest amount of friction. I can, I can, I can like minimize chafing that way. I don't get any blisters. It's impossible for my feet to have blisters on because of how tightly they wrap when I'm on the bike. I lace them up the proper tightness and everything. I dress the body up my, I mean the, the rest of the same, same kind of deal. I have a hoodie. Most of the time, just this 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 thing, this champion, this uh, you can find it in the Target, and I have a either a Marilina collar T-shirt, or I would have just the regular like <coughs> the the average buttoned-up collared T-shirt, whatever I can find, whatever I could reach for the first when I go into my closet but I, I have underneath of that I have like an undershirt like fruit of the loom like a cotton t-shirt this thing has a t-shirt a front pocket right on the right on my breast right here it's usually the spot right where I secure the radio because then I can button it up the rest of the way within within the color, like the, the buttons in there. It's, it's like, ever since I figured out how to do that, how to dress up that way and specifically, I, I have never dropped my, my radio ever, anywhere. It's impossible. Even if I hang upside down, it won't fall. It's cool though. I've been able to even take it into work. In the past, I used to all the time. Now it's just they play the music so loud. There's no point in bringing it in there if you can't hear it. <laughs> I would still take it, honestly, but I can't. I don't wear those AirPods at all. I have a fear of having any shit in my ears because I want to be able to clearly listen to my, my surroundings. What if I get hit by a bus because of this trendy new hipster thing. It's the fake hipster. That's what these people are. They're like the plastic version of what a hipster would be. They don't know anything about what hipster. Hipster is the original thing. I was the original hipster. They, no, they're not. They're not. They, they can't be me. <laughs> My ways are not the ways of this world. I, I come. The father who sent me, I come to save 
these these type of these types of people because they need a savior. I I came because my my flesh and blood is heavenly, is divine. I was sent here, you know. He 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 that believes unto me, he's gonna. <laughs> Oh yeah. He, he would he would end up like yeah right right back right right back where the where from start to finish. Oh yeah, like like with peace I leave you. With peace I give you. With peace I leave you, or whatever. And when I come back though, I'm gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna have this kingdom. You see. Mm. You gotta eat my flesh and you drink my blood. <laughs> you see, that's where it starts. It's the first step. Mm. As long as you're in communion with me. Oh. Oh, this is lots of protein per serving, right? How much? <laughs> this has got oh, 16 grams in each can. Mm. Well, the last thing I ate was sausage yesterday, though. Sometimes you don't have to do very much cooking in the middle of the week and, and stuff. The, what do you what do you cook in the middle of your work week? Otherwise, you'd starve if you didn't, right? And what do you do? Do you, you just order out? You go Chick Fil A, right? That's where you go to. You cheap, cheap petty person. What, what's wrong with you? Get a life. Damn prick! I hope that. I hope shit on you. I wish curses upon your family, everything. Like, you're gonna end up having bad luck, just like I did. <laughs> if you keep it up with your shitty attitude, cheap ass, fuck you, prick. No, like, suck my cock, you fucking weirdo. I hope, <laughs> I hope shit on you and your whole fucking descendants and everything. Because your ancestors was, you son of a bitch. Oh my God, this <sighs> pissed me off though, you people. Mm. You bet, I bet you have to wipe your ass right now as we speak. You're such a stupid, careless, so mindless. When you use the toilet, you don't even wipe. You fucking dirty ass. Go take a shower, brush your fucking teeth, wash your mouth out too, brush off your tongue, make sure you get, get like all the Ebola, all the yeast, the candida, scrub it out of your tongue, manually. Sicko. Such a fucking pervert. What type of porn do you look at? Weird ass. I bet you sleazy ass, you... Fucking have sick fantasies, fetishize about uh, your perversion, your lust. What's wrong with you? Get the hit. get your mind out of the gutter, freak. You're damn so horny. You get get your rocks off and get out of my face with your damn penis. I want that shit in my sight. I would shit on your whole fucking everything. Fuck you. You want to ban me from Instagram? <laughs> Fuck you. I said that. Take me off of this shit. Take away my page too here. And see what happens. Let's find out. See how angry I get. 
<laughs> I'm just getting started. <laughs>